Hey guys, welcome back to Tamiya Legends and once again thank you for stopping by. Um, I've just about come to the end of the Terra Sculpture now, um, so I thought it'd be fun today, just before, while it's got all the running gear in it, just to do a quick comparison video. I say comparison, we want to run, the, run it with a standard 540 silver cam and then swap it and run it with the 11 turn super modified, so basically one extreme to the other of the brushed motors. Um, so I've got a brand new 540 um, fitted which came with the top force kit. Um, we're, we're only running 7.2 NIM, no LiPo, uh, and as you can see I've made a few changes to the car. So basically I've put the old original shell back on, um, I don't want to damage the new one now. And I've also, I didn't want to damage the Terra Scorcher wheels and tyres. Um, because the vintage now here's the thing these are genuine 88 of anti-vintage wheels and tires but um they are showing signs of cracks and they've had a little bit of use so i've actually got brand new re, -re ones for my avanti restore um, but i think it looks pretty cool with them on to be fair um, so well, that's enough talking so as i say it's just gonna be a very quick video i think when you do these when you do these kind of comparisons on the same on the same video it just you can see the difference in speed whereas if you just do a video of a 540 and then a separate video there's a gap in between and you can't see the difference so hopefully we'll be able to see the, the massive difference in them so let's get cracking right let's see what the 540's got i forgot to say this is running a 15 tooth pinion as well I'll tell you what it looks absolutely awesome with those avanti wheels You why it's not. I thought it'd be a bit slower. Let's try a couple of ovals. Well that ran really well with the Silver Cam 540, it was actually a little bit quicker than I thought which tells me because I ran the 19 turn Dynatech O1R in this the other day and I thought it was pretty quick so I think the gearing in this in this buggy itself is quite quick um, just so, I don't know if I said this earlier, it's a 15 tooth pinion we're running as standard so that's sort of right in the middle range for this buggy so let's get the motors changed over and get the super modified in there Right, let's see what it goes like with the super modified in. Obviously, I'm not going to rag it because I don't want to destroy this car. So, wow. What's actually happening is the wheels are just spinning inside the tyres. That's why it's sliding. get a flyby. Some orbals. Just can't get the power down at all. It's just slipping. Oh, it's quick.
just couldn't get my power down. Um, obviously vintage 88 tyres, so they need scrubbing in. The wheels were definitely slipping on the tyres and obviously it's wet. But hopefully you got a gist of how quick it is. And that's a 7.2 NIM, never mind LiPo. This motor is just absolutely cock on, I love it to bits. Um, right, I hope you enjoyed that. Once again, thanks for watching. If you're new to this channel, if you could please consider liking and subscribing to support us, that would be much appreciated. But most of all, happy assing.